Hi everyone, well, welcome back to another video about uh, Drupal. This time I'm going to show you how to install Drush 8 on Windows 10. Uh, because yeah, if you're working on uh, Drupal 8, you need Drush 8. So installing uh, Drush on uh, Ubuntu or Linux machine uh, fairly simple, but uh, uh, when it comes to Windows, it is a bit involved. But uh, there are few steps you need to follow, uh, not that hard. Uh, so anyway, I'm Ajit Ekhanayaka, so um, I'm doing uh, Drupal development, I have been doing it since 2008, so um, let me uh, show you the steps first. So these are the steps, um, so install Drush 8 on Windows 10, here. so you need to install this particular uh, program called CYG Win. You can download it, download it from www.cygwin.com and then and after that you need to add certain packages I will go through them and also you need to uh, download and install Composer that is uh, you can get it from um, getcomposer.org slash download so I have already opened up this here. yes so www.cygwin.com so you can download uh, depending on your system 32 bit or 64 bit mine is 64 bits I have I have already downloaded this uh, software and also you need to download uh, composer that is from getcomposer.org slash download slash whatever and then you can you can download composer dash setup dot exe so I have already downloaded them you can see it this is setup and the uh, and then compose setup so um, after downloading you can just install them so you can double click on setup exe for the uh, cyg win say yes and go next uh, remember that I have already installed so I will just go through the steps and then specify the path so I just copy this one and then uh, go next. So I just put copy that one and put a directory called maybe source or whatever. And so just to install the downloaded software, uh, the, the packages, go next. So uh, should be a direct connection nowadays. So go next. So select the uh, the 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 close. Um, uh, the mirror so I am from Australia so I just uh, use something like in ending with a u or whatever anyway the you have to select the uh, uh, mirror from here and then go next uh, so uh, when you uh, when you are installing this one for the first time the screen will be different but because I have since I have already done the installation it won't give you the initial screen here but I will try to um, uh, explain you how you how you go through to go through and install the necessary packages the packages you need to install uh, in curses git bsd tar and curl remember these four these four you you, ne you need to download in order to uh, for the uh, drush to work properly so it incurses git bsd tar and curl so how do you uh, select them for example if you go in curses uh, here in the in the first uh, the uh, installation you will see that these are all these the list of packages you can just type in curses or whatever and then uh, so for example I will just say not install for example so you can anyway don't worry about the my screen you have to type in cursors here in cursors then you can see that since I have already installed that particular in cursors package you can't see it here so um, if not uh, you you dis, you would see it in cursors here then the, for example assuming assuming that I want to install something else I can just click on that it will automatically select this uh, this uh, checkbox so find the word in cursors here and then just click on the uh, the line then it will install for you uh, it will install it for you and the other one you need to ins install is uh, uh, what is that 
git and bsd ta so type git here <coughs> so here you can't find just the word git here because since i did install that particular package so you can see other git so the, i'm not going to install any any uh, any other software here just the git so just find the git the word just the git and then select the line and the other one you need is bsd ta bsd bsd ta so here you you won't see it because i have already done the installation if not there will uh, it there was a one line here and then you can just select that line it will select so the other one you need is curl this is very important otherwise you can't disable packages uh, one, i mean disable the uh, modules when you run the uh, drush this if you do if if you if you're not going to install this one you can you can uh, 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 then the drush can uncompress the package and install it for you and git you need and in cursors this is another uh, uh, necessary package for the, uh, uh, the drush to work so and after that assuming that you have so you can go next and then it will install all everything it will take some time maybe about 10 to 15 minutes and once everything done you can uh, close that one so and you will since I have already done it it is in my C CWB all the binaries in C Y G V 64 dash B so just highlight that one and copy go to because you need to add this uh, bin directory to the uh, your environment path so go to my this PC go to properties and go to advanced system setting go to environment variable and go select the path and then edit and so you have to click new to add another one so I can copy this one since I have already done it, I am not going to do it again. So you can just new and then type, uh, copy and the paste your the, the pad. So I cancel this one, cancel. So so assuming uh, I have done the 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 pad setting that is done. Then you have to um, since we have already downloaded the uh, the this one composer. You can install this one has a normal uh, exe program so it will go at next 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 that's all so so you can go next next and it will be uh, installing on your system so now <coughs> after you have done these uh, steps there's only one more steps to do so we have done this one we have done this one we have done this one now only thing you need to do is install drush using the composer just type this command for that i can go to a command prompt maybe and then type from anywhere just say composer global you have to put global because then um, it will it will be installing globally so anybody can using this machine can uh, use that uh, drush so remember to put global and then just say require require and then you need drush and then what you need what drush you need again specify drush call them the version you need so i need 8 plus the latest 8 uh, version of the 8 i um, mean the version 8 of the drush so once you enter this one it will it will take some time so i'm going i'm not going to do this one i'm going to cancel it so i have already done it so um so now we have done the cyg win and the composer so go to your whatever the directory you want to run from so maybe w and maybe so this is my web root i want to install uh, i want to download uh, drupal 8 now so drush 
for example, it's just type version, trash version. See, everything's fine. Yeah, so 8.12, that is the uh, latest version of the 8 release. So now you can type normal trash camera, trash download the year to pro. So if you type this particular just Drupal, it will download the latest version of the Drupal in the, uh, at the moment's 8, version 8, so hopefully it get 8.3 something. So just type uh, this. It will take some time. Uh, let me go to directory where I started the command. Yeah, this is the command. Still not there, nothing, nothing there. So let me, hopefully we will see something. Excuse me. Still not there. So I just want to prove that I have done the uh, thing properly. So hopefully we will see something on this. Yep. So you can see that that was I'm getting the latest Drupal release. 8.3.6 so that is how you install Drush on Windows 10 so um, because you need uh, Drush 8 for Win uh, Drupal 8 so remember the steps so um, uh, hopefully you can repeat the same steps and get the Drush 8 installed on your Windows 10 so thank you for watching uh, see you in another video thank you